teachers. In this video, we are going to go over some of the process and procedures to ensure success utilizing Canvas for your semester tests. First, we're going to review how to create question banks inside of Canvas to utilize inside of your actual test. This is the best way to first start creating questions for quizzes or tests in Canvas. You simply go into the course that you're wanting to create these in, then go to the quiz button. Once there, you just click on the gear at the top right, and you'll see Manage Question Banks. This is the path you take to create your questions. If you have created questions and tests without using this format, in this box you will have unfiled questions. You can move those to filed questions and organize them whichever way you would like. This gives you some more ability in the future of using your questions. When you're ready to build, just click on Add Question Bank. You can create it. And for this, I'm going to call it Semester Test. Click Enter. And then when I open up Semester Test, I will now have options to build my questions. At the top right, you'll see Add Question. This is just what it looks like inside of quizzes when you build a test. But this route, you're creating the questions first to be utilized in the test later. This makes it easy to go and search and find them for usage at a different time. There are other videos on BA Fusion in the Canvas video tutorial section it goes over question creation. Remember, you can always reach out to one of the members of the success team for help as well. I now have two question banks created. Now we are ready to create a quiz. And if you have used Canvas to give your quizzes and tests throughout your year and you have a cumulative final, it is very easy for you to create your semester test utilizing questions from each of the tests and quizzes you have previously made as long as you use question banks. I will show you that step in the next part. So now that you have question banks created, you can come to quizzes and you can start building your actual quiz instance. So as you can see, we don't have any quizzes, but we have questions that we have built into Canvas. So now we click on quiz, we give it a name, Now let's go ahead and bring the questions in from the question banks that we created. We will go over the settings for your exam in the next video. At the top, click the questions tab. You will have three options, new question, new question group, and find questions. You would only use new question if you did not create question banks and you would actually create the questions right here. The downside of that is that they're not organized into banks for later use but you can do it that way. The one in the middle here is new question group. This is where you can use multiple question banks to create your quiz questions. For instance, if you gave 10 quizzes over the course of the semester, you could include all question banks from that quiz in groups through this tab. It will also randomize the questions and do a couple other neat features that we could talk more about if you are interested. The last one is what we're going to use, and this is Find Questions. Click there. On the left side, you'll see all of the question banks that you have created in all courses inside of Canvas. You can see the name of the question bank, and right underneath, you'll see the course name and the number of questions in that bank. The questions we created were right here, called Semester Test. All you need to do is click there, and then you can say Select All Questions. Now if you were selecting multiple banks and only certain questions, you could go through and just click the questions that you want. But in most cases, you would just want to click select all to pull in all the questions. Then we just say add questions. And it brings all the questions in automatically. If you want to find more, you can click find questions and bring in even more. Once done and you have the details of the test all finished, you just click save and make sure that it is published and your students are ready to take their quiz. Let us know if you have any questions and I hope this helps. Have a great day.